Alright, let's try to have a view of us together. And we'll see how we fight this. Oh god! <laughs> Hey everybody, I'm Josh. And I'm Rachel. And come along with us as we check out the most popular beach here in Trinidad. Maracas Beach. We're also going to check out a amazing, <laughs> water just hit our feet, an amazing lookout and hopefully try to try some of their local cuisine. Bacon shark is on the menu. Let's go. Good morning, everybody. We are coming to you from Port of Spain, Trinidad. First time. That's right. From our research, though, it doesn't count as a new country because Trinidad and Tobago are one country. Right. And we were there yesterday. So yes. if you haven't seen that video, go check that out. Um, but we do have a planned excursion today. We are going to the most popular beach on the island, Maracas Beach. Yes, we do believe it's going to take us a little bit of a trek to get there. 45 minutes to an hour, I think is what we read. I think I read an hour. Yeah. But we will bring beach you day. along. Yeah. <laughs> And they're supposed to be one of the best photo ops, too, along the way. Yeah. Good morning. We are doing breakfast in the main dining room to start the day. Starting out with some coffee, some orange juice, and a fruit plate. All right, so I ended up getting the breakfast burrito. Just got some scrambled eggs. That said chorizo, but it looks like ham to me. And then a tri tater. What did you get here? Ham, cheese, spinach, tomato, olive. Fresh tomato, freshly made, and then um, some toast. We did run up to Cafe Latitudes. We thought about getting an extra coffee, but we are not. Uh, we are going to take in this view. It's an interesting looking port so far. Uh, we do have an excursion planned today, and we also might get up on the uh, pool deck, but you can see fruit Danish. Yeah, fruit Danish. Muesli and chocolate donut. Interesting thing of note, they just announced overhead that camouflage clothing of any sort is prohibited in Trinidad. I would guess there's some military things, so change your packing. some shops right as we get off the ship. We don't have time for it right now, but we will definitely make it back here at the end. Inside the terminal. Yeah, inside terminal. Let me go, there's no doubt. It. Gotta get out of this small town. You took my heart from me. Now you're everywhere I see. Let me fly, let me fly new kinds of highs We're just wasting here, waiting for another year We both know the score, we've been here once before 
so many words unspoken You took my heart, it's already broken You don't have to wait I can take the pain I will surrender, let me go On a new adventure So we've been riding for a little over 30 minutes, I think. Maybe 45. I'm not sure. It's been an actually beautiful drive. And check this out. Just Rachel taking a picture. So beautiful. I don't think they will do it justice, but like this is a magnificent view. All right, I think we're about 30, 45 minutes into the drive. This is a beautiful lookout. Oh my oh God. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I, I'm like blown away. The drive, yes. I thought I'd be able to nap. The views are too pretty. Yeah, no, and that's why I'm unsure how long it's been because it's been so beautiful. We're looking out the windows the entire time. Yeah, it's so gorgeous. And the road is crazy though. <laughs> I would not drive this. <laughs> True story. But we're gonna try to grab some snacks here. Um, got some photos and we'll get to the beach. So we did grab a couple items. Uh, this is the sweet peach. Oh, nice. And then pepper, honey, mango. And this was a total of $3 US. They do give you your change and uh, local currency. So I actually have some small bills now. Actually, that might be good because I think the bathroom's a charge at the beach. Okay. Okay, sweet peach, baby. Is it wet? Um, sort of. Alright, it looks decent. I really like the texture. You're gonna like this. Alright, <laughs> maybe we'll have to get more later. Yeah, that's good. Alright, welcome to Maracas Beach. Um, we should be here for a little under three hours. Grant picked up at 2.30, but this is amazing. Such a beautiful setting. There is a bunch of places where it looks like we can grab some food, grab some drinks. Um, yeah, I can't wait. Uh, it is a little bit windy. It is kind of wavy. But you can see it's a beautiful, beautiful area. And the beers are back there. There's quite a few waves. Oh gosh! <laughs> I do not think that snorkeling is in the cards for today. It seems like snorkeling won't happen today. Because I see a lot of uh, soot riling up down below. Yeah, it's very oh, uneven. Yeah, it is quite uneven. Oh god, I don't think I want to go too far. Okay. <laughs> Although now I'm tall again. Cool. There's our backdrop. Oh god. Ha <laughs> 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 All right, 
I would say, I think the hour was worth it in the car. Yeah. What's that? What's really cool about it is you can feel like the sand getting pulled away from you as the water gets closer. Oh, yeah, you can. You feel that? Yeah. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. Oh, holy crap. I got, I got the boot on that one. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, this is what you do. You just fight the waves here. I think it's a blast though. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, she went under. <laughs> that was a big one. Oh god, look at this. No. All right, let's try to have a view of us here. Together? And we'll see how we fight this. Oh, God! <laughs> All right, there you go. We made it. Right. Oh, God. Oh, here it comes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. We'll bring you back when we grab some food and beers, probably, but we'll just be doing this for a while. Freaking out. Awesome. If it wasn't so wavy, I bet there would be good snorkeling over there by those rocks, but... I don't think we can risk it. No, I'm not going to snorkel on this, I don't think. Oh, heads up! Yeah. It's actually easier when you get further out, because yeah. it's before they break. Yeah, you can just jump. Yeah, I like it that way too. Yeah. I like getting hit by them, but it's really fun to have it <laughs> lifted up. This is gorgeous. I love it. Give me a beer and a bacon shark. <laughs> by the way, it's bake and shark, shark. Yeah. not the, bacon shark. The bake is the bread. Yeah. That's what they call fry bread. And the beer is the drink. <laughs> and then what we'll probably get to go along with our bake and shark. Actually, I saw there was a bake and shrimp. Ooh, I kind of want to find that, that one too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, there is so many options for food yeah. that we are not going to be starving to death. That's no. Weird. I think we'll be pretty, pretty solid. Yeah. Uh, but we're just going to play in the water for a while. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> <laughs> I could feel it pick me up, but I couldn't do anything yeah, about it. Yeah, it like it. literally is sucking the water from underneath of us. I couldn't do anything about it. And, oh god, look at this one. <laughs> oh, big one, big one coming. Oh my oh god, my look god. at this. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Yeah, I'm good. Oh god, another one. Watch out! Whoa. Oh. All right. I can't stop recording because it's so fun. Watch out! Oh. Okay, I should say, as I put the camera away, um, we did get two chairs, 20 US dollars. I'm sure there's cheaper prices. If we're on vacation, we're happy to pay what they're asking. And this is them. And we're going back out. Just a little heads up. Um, the waves are very rough. And sometimes bathing suits will move when you are getting hit by waves. Just saying. So we love the beach. But we don't actually know what the red flag means. 
It's probably that we aren't supposed to do too much running, but um, if you do know what the colors mean, let us know. We weren't the only people out there though, and it was a ton of fun. So there's a bunch of these little kind of shacks, restaurants, whatever you want to call them on the beach, where you can come grab all the food. It seems like they all have a pretty simple, similar menu. All right, I feel like we're landing on Patsy's. What a great view. All right, you may be surprised, but we over-ordered. Um, this is a beef pie. And you can see it is quite large. Sweet potato fries, large. Um, this is the bake and shark, which I did put on the sauces they recommend. There's three sauces they recommend. There's a tamarind, a garlic, and there's something else. And I'll oh, record I can it. Smell a there is a heat one too. And like, they've actually got a warning sign by it. And I put it on both of them too. Okay. <laughs> And then and um, shrimp one? added pineapple. You can, yeah, you add your own sauces. Oh, okay. Yeah, check that out. Oh my God. Yum. This is gonna be so good. <laughs> and it was, um, if we did our math right, it was uh, somewhere around $32 for the two beers and all this food, which seems like a great deal, especially for a beach food. Yeah. All right, take a look at this sucker. <laughs> it's huge. It is a monster. How's the shark? It's a good thing you got that pineapple on it because something's got to cut that heat. Is it really hot? Yeah. That's, all right. Well, maybe I shouldn't have done that. But like the shrimp one is just as big. These are monsters. It's going to be great. Yep. So I can already feel this dough seems so awesome because it does feel like it's, you know, freshly fried. Yeah. It's got that good crisp on the outside. <clears throat> I think Josh is going to be buying me another beer. Don't you worry about it, sister. <laughs> That's delicious. The bread is amazing. I love the bread on um, it. And then the shrimp. It's got a good little fry to it. There's just tons of flavor. I absolutely love this. Super hot. All right, we just got done eating at Patsy's. Frickin' delicious. Oh my gosh, it was so good. Oh, this beach it's the, sand is Yep, hot. I was gonna say the sand is ridiculously hot right now, but, um, so we'll make it quick. Um, couple beers, We've and- We've been trying just the Karib, and I'll be telling yeah. you, these other ones, like Karib pineapple, and I got Josh a Shandy, they're good. It's very good, this one's lime. Um, but I really like the bacon shrimp the most. I actually like the bacon shark better. Yeah. The fry on it today was much better. I think if you watch, go back and watch our yesterday Barbados video, or Barbados day, day video, um, it really was. We're walking on ridiculously hard things right now. Yeah, the so fry was. Stop. The fry was a little <laughs> off for me, but today's fry. Yeah, was this was really a little bit more crisp. Um, and don't mind my squinting. Yeah. Sunglasses down in the. They ocean. were lost to the ocean today. <laughs> um, the beef. Pie, I thought was like an empanada. So if you like those, uh, sweet potato fries were amazing. Check out Patsy's. We ate them all. <laughs> yep.
hour drive back and we are now at the cruise port. There is a arts and crafts um, area. Yes. Um, everybody, by the way, has been taking a US dollar. So in case you're doing that, some of them are taking credit cards. So it's very easy. I did not exchange any money. Um, but overall, I thought that was an awesome, awesome excursion. I Definitely agree. recommend. I agree. And the other nice part is, is nobody seems extremely pushy. They take no. no thank you pretty well. Yes, mm -hmm. I agree with that. First lava flows of the trip. Yum, yum. Yeah, check out that rum. <laughs> Strawberry uh, puree and pina colada. Best there is. So we came into the solarium after hanging out at the pool for a while. Um, the hot tub is hot. The pool is cold. The room was nice. It was very peaceful. Um, and then the pizza line is getting pretty long over there. The roast beef looks a little bit better this time than what we had, though. Grab some coffee and go get ready for the night. Well, we tried to come up and catch the sunset. Yeah. So right now we are over three on this cruise. <laughs> Luckily we did make it for the Barbados one on the beach. Um, but the clouds beat us to it tonight, apparently. Yeah. Dang it. Dang it. All right, what do we got planned? Uh, dinner. I think yes. there is a comedian tonight, two comedians. There's a comedian or a magician comedian? comedian? Or a magician juggler? Yeah, maybe that's it. And then a adults only comedian later on. Right. Night. But we have taken off, um, which when you are in the room the next to the very end, um, you definitely know when you're taking off because you can hear the anchor taking off and the yes. propulsion or something. It's loud. It's very loud. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, we do intend to do a couple different shows or games or something tonight. Um, our goal is to stay out of the casino for a little bit, so yeah, we'll you see. might get a bunch of stuff. You might not. <laughs> who knows? We'll see how that works. First. We also have to go shopping right now. Yes, we gotta go find some sunglasses <laughs> for this one. <laughs> Let's go. So a neat little thing that I just noticed, even though we've been up here a couple times, um, right on the front of the ship, you have a little peek into the buffet. So what do they got for dinner tonight? It's Caribbean night, I believe. So I believe there's some jerk chicken over there. That looks like jerk chicken right there. Some kind of balls. <laughs> I was gonna say the same thing. Uh, um, salami <laughs> and cheese. And look, some salad. And yep, some salad, fruit, oh, bun of sort. That's hamburgers and hot dogs over there. That's the topic for hamburgers and hot dogs. Oh. Hamburgers and hot dogs. I do love a hot dog. There you go. But I just thought it was kind of neat that we just randomly looked down and found that out. And we do think that we actually made the sunset. It's just the clouds kind of yeah, kind of put Josh a damper on a it. Picture that I'm pretty sure shows the sunset. Yes, Eddie and Josh insert now. <laughs> All right, let's go find some sunglasses and go to dinner. <laughs> All right, so on the ship, I'm gonna grab some $30 sunglasses. And then over here, we're actually buying some extra sunscreen. We 
we have sunscreen, but we feel like we probably need more because we've been kind of hammered with sun so far. And we've still got four more excursion days. <laughs> but you can always get something here. It's going to be a markup, but at least you can get your stuff. Tonight. This is the Asian style um, pork tacos on a bao. And then this is the coconut, coconut, shrimp. coconut shrimp. And it's got some sauce with it. Sweet chili sauce, I know that. Yeah, there you go. Alright, it is Caribbean night, so why would you not get the jerk chicken? Or, nope, jerk pork. pork. And it looks like a fried plantain, some rice and beans. No idea what this is, but I'll probably put that in. And then also the tiger shrimp with rice, vegetables, and more vegetables. <laughs> I was trying to think of something Might different about the tomato. I'd call it a uh, succotash. All right. All right, and here's the real deal. This is chicken korma. Uh, so, we are continuing our new tradition of getting the Indian course as our finisher. <laughs> and we got some roti and I believe it's pompadoms. Maybe that's what it is, yeah. Sure. But there we go. We're excited for it. The smell is good. All right, we've got a pineapple sunshine cake. Um, and a brownie. It doesn't show very well on camera, but it looks decent. And I don't believe there are nuts on that. I don't believe there's nuts on that. Are you ready for some laughs? Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together. From the United Kingdom, our comedy star, John Maloney. Wow. All right, we are back in our room. We did go to three different shows tonight. Yeah. Um, there was a cabaret. Jazz cabaret. It was more like just jazz singing. Yeah. Unless I just don't know don't what the know. definition of cabaret yeah, is. Yeah, we, we thought there was some other kind of cabaret, yeah. which, I mean, there were some fancy dress carnival ladies in Trinidad, so who knew? But nope, it was singing, um, and it was fine. And then uh, we did do the magician. I thought was, his uh, tricks were good, his jokes were bad. <laughs> I think yeah. he goes for bad jokes. He could work on them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he could read every single one of them from a bad dad jokes book. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. And then the uh, comedian, we did the adult comedy, um, and it was way better than <laughs> when we saw him at the um, opener, where it's very generic and stuff. Yeah, he was super funny. <laughs> Dinner tonight, um, the Caribbean food, for the most part, was kind of bland. It was. But, once again, the winner is the Indian food. Yeah. If you like big flavor and you like Indian food, we are big fans of it. So yeah. far, it's been our favorite dish three nights all three nights. Yep. Yeah. Um, we, tonight, it was... Chicken korma. 
Yes, which we actually enjoy anyway. Mm -hmm. All right, best moment of the day. For me, it was being in the ocean and playing in those waves. And Josh and this other gentleman were <laughs> laughing like little boys. Like they truly were just running into the waves and crashing into the waves. And we had so it much so fun. It was so fun. It was, it was truly, and you could see a bunch of adults out there just acting like little yeah, kids I in mean, a wave pool. <laughs> it, it was, was awesome. like the craziest wave pool ever. Holy yeah, crap. That was I'm, my best I'm part. hoping that like some of the scenes capture how tall the waves were or they yeah. at least seemed they were. Um, yeah, that was a blast. 100%. That was my favorite moment of the day as well. Yeah. Favorite bite of the day. Chicken korma. That uh, stuff was good. What? Yeah, I am telling you, like, I have been... I, I, tomorrow, well, tomorrow night we're doing something different, but I am almost tempted to stop ordering anything else and just order this. I think that's probably a wise decision. Um, but for me, I'm still going with the bake and shrimp. Yeah, I really enjoyed that. The sweet potato fries was, also were freaking awesome. <laughs> the sweet potato fries are a good one as well, but chicken yeah. korma, sweet potato fries. <laughs> the yeah. chicken korma was very, very good. Mm -hmm. All right. On that note, tomorrow we are going to Grenada. Mm -hmm. I believe it's Grenada, I not Grenada. That's how you pronounce it as well. Um, we actually have some river tubing that we are going to be doing, as well as the chef's table. So if you're enjoying hey. this kind of content and you want to see that kind of content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and watch our next video. Go ahead and watch, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and watch our next video. That's right. If you're enjoying our videos. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I was going to go into that. Oh. <laughs> if you're enjoying our videos, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. You can also follow us on social media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All our links are down below. Good night.